Hey guys, it's Jennifer and I'm back with another video for you guys. So today I have two guests. Once again, we are filming this on the same day if you've seen our previous video. Same outfits. Yeah, we're all wearing the same outfits. We thought about changing, but then we did. So hello. <laughs> so we are filming two videos today and this video is actually going to be another challenge to test their knowledge on me. So today's video, yeah, on fashion this time. Basically, they're going to have to pick out two outfits two outfits each that they think that I would wear during fall season, just because fall is here now. So, um, yeah, they're going to go in my closet. They have permission to go into my closet. Let's do it. You just got to do this. Ready? One, two, three. Hey. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Yay! Okay, for the first look, Jennifer has a dog named Bear, so we're going to call it the Bear Invitation. Yes, look at this. It screams bear. Oh, it's an animal. Okay, we're gonna take this animal. Oh yeah, it's a tiger. It's white like bear. It goes with the theme. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> she has a leopard print. <laughs> Back up. I have a better outfit. Stitch. No, the leopard. Stitch as well. Because it'll stitch. Yeah, it ran out of focus. Done. Yeah. My bear inspired outfit is better. Sure. Turn it off. Okay. Okay. So we are, or they are done picking out their items. It's supposed to be fall. Okay. The requirements are fall related clothes or fall inspired outfits I guess and then things that I would wear. So let's start with Daya. Please show me one of your outfits. Okay, this is bear inspired. So you have bear's beautiful coat and then there is a white tiger but it's white like bear so, and it's an animal. <laughs> this is my PJs. <laughs> and just black pants. And then if you want, you can have bear with your scarf. Um, just at first glance, uh, this is not an outfit I put together, <laughs> but I can see it might work because they're neutral colors. Ta -da. This is the outfit by Dania, outfit number one. I don't know, did you want me to tuck it in or something? I think tucking it in better. Tuck, tuck it in will be better. I don't know if that'll save the look, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> Um, this is the look. My thought. Uh, I would wear it. <laughs> I'm gonna rate this out of out of five. I'm gonna rate this oh, a one. You respect that? You respect this whole one? Richard, can I see yours? Okay. <laughs> Okay, uh, okay. Well, he has to, he has to oh. finish explaining. Oh. I don't know why. Just because, you know, I bought her this for Christmas. Oh I, I thought that was going to be the main reason. And since it's fall, you got to wear a jacket you know, to keep warm. This is not a single outfit on its own. No. no. This is like a bedtime outfit though, right? Or is it like... No. Go out outfit? Going to one occasion. And what occasion would I wear this together? You keep warm. Because it's soft. Because it's soft, then you know, for extra warmth, then you hold stitch to make sure people know it. <laughs> yeah. Outfit, Richard's outfit. Uh, I'm actually sweating. <laughs> it's actually really hot. Um, I appreciate that he was very considerate about my, I guess, how cold I'd be in fall. I'm a little confused when I looked in the mirror. I put it on. I was a little confused because I, I understood like this combination, this, but why the breastfeed jacket? It looks cool. Valid reason. Valid reason. I say I rate this outfit as much as I love this onesie. I'm gonna stuck stitchy. 
I think I'm gonna rate this outfit a one. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's really hot. I feel really sweaty. Okay, this pink dress. Oh, I like this pink dress. It's cute. And yes. to keep you warm, you have this cardigan. Okay, this is cute. Okay. <laughs> It was cute. It was cute. But I can't walk around with this. I mean, <laughs> I can. I just feel like this will be your clutch. You just can't put anything in it. Okay. It was. It was going well. She pulled out the pink dress. She pulled out the cardigan. And I was like, okay, I'd wear this. This is not bad. And then, and then the clutch. She was so close. <laughs> so close. And this is the second outfit by Dania. I actually don't mind it. It feels like a little bit short, I will say. If I wore heels though, I could see myself actually wearing it in the fall because I do really like this dress and I do really like chunky sweaters. This is still questionable. I don't know why this is part of the outfit still, but that it is. So I think I could make it work. I mean, I, I'll have to cut a hole in the unicorn to make it like actually practical and useful. I think I'd break this. Oh, I'd say a three and a half. Three and a half. It's pretty close. Out of five, that's not bad. Um, the only reason you lost marks is because of this. I don't get it. Okay. Because, you know, geek. Yep. Self explanatory, apparently. So, okay. I drew that. Jenny from the block. Fur. Jacket. Okay. Wow. Yeah. You know Jenny from the blog. Jennifer Lopez. Yes. Rip jeans. I was expecting you know bigger holes for the rip. This one the actually has a massive rip. <laughs> it's like almost the crotch area. I'm glad you picked this. And this is Richard's last outfit, and I'm not mad about it. It's actually not bad, but it's so sweet fall. So would I be cold? Exposing my arms. Not cold when it's cool. It's, I'd be cold still if it's cool. Like this and this look really cute together. I don't think I'll wear this with it. Um, I understand that he wants to go for a J-Lo vibe. I don't know if he accomplished that in today's look. But this isn't awful. It's weird, his first outfit was too hot because there was a onesie and a sweater. This one is going to be too cold because of the ripped pants, sleeveless. But I gave it a three probably. I am back from trying all the outfits and the final results. Drum roll please. Anyway. <gasps> yes! She won your face! She won because of the dress and cardigan combo. As much as I didn't mind Richard's second outfit, it wasn't super fall appropriate because it's ripped jeans and sleeveless. And we live in Canada, so fall is really, really cold here. So, yeah. We need a punishment. What would be... Oh. Oh, <laughs> it's kind of an idea. But it could be a really bad idea. What if... No, spider. <laughs> what? I'm gonna get you a spider. No, no, what? <laughs> no. What if, since I live at a busy intersection, if you went out and did like a little dance to the corner? What? <laughs> Go out on the intersection, do a little dance. <laughs> it's happening. There's the man of the hour. <laughs> He's gonna do his punishment and it's so exciting. I'm low key living for the second hand embarrassment I'm about to feel or experience. Okay, go. What am I doing? For five seconds. Okay, tell just, me just start. Okay, go. Sir. No? <laughs> no, face us so I can record it. Yeah, okay, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> this guy is such a loser. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Okay, we're back and Richard just uh 
that did his punishment. Thoughts? It was weird at the moment. Any dance move would have been like kind of like, like normal, but the body weight was just like sensual in the, on the corner. And, but <laughs> I'm feeling good about this punishment. Thank you so much for watching, and their channels will be linked down below again. PD Penguins, PD Penguins. Um, links down below. Subscribe to them if you want more foodie vlogs because that's what they do. But thanks so much for watching, and I will see you next week. Bye. Fly, baby, fly with you. Yeah.